So good day, I am Mark Vincent Mbongo and I'm going to report about uh, Brugia Malay. So the contents are about round, the roundworm, the epidemiology and risk factor, then the biology, diagnosis and the treatment. So uh, first, what is Brugia Malay? Brugia Malay is one of the parasitic nematodes that cause lymphatic filariasis, filariasis, which affects 120 million people worldwide. And it is transmitted by Mansonia mosquitoes. The, mosqui the female mosquitoes reach about a maximum diameter of 180 uh, micrometer and the males are much smaller which up to uh, 90 micrometer so what is uh, okay then it is one of the tropical diseases targeted for elimination by the year 2020 by the world health organization which has spurred vaccine and drug development as well as new methods of vector control so next is what are the symptoms of a roundworm infection first is that in the infection and swelling of the lymphatic system then the primarily caused by the presence of worms in the lymphatic vessels and the resulting inflammatory response of the host. Then how is roundworm infection spread? It is transmitted by a mosquito vector, then the mosquitoes from an open swamps and rice growing areas, and also the mosquito bites is required to establish the infection. So, what are the uh, life cycle of uh, Brugia malai? So, there is two naidwaka stage, which is um, human stages and the mosquito stage. So, first is that the mosquito takes a blood meal sa tao nang ipaksa. Then, kaning mosquito mag-inject siya o katong larvae. Mali nang the larvae will come into adult cell lymphatics. Then third is that cunning adults produce a sheath micro uh, that reach the bloodstream then ang parasite. Then the mosquito takes a blood meal sa tao dayon then pag pag take niya og blood kay na ingest niya ang micro microfilaria Ray, Ray, then the microfilariated sheath penetrate mosquitoes mid, mid gut and migrate to the thoracic muscles. Then, na dayon ang maform din ang L1 larvae, then the L3 larvae, then it migrates to the head of mosquitoes proboscis, proboscis. Then, Back to the cycle, which is a mosquito takes a blood meal. Mali nang ma-ingest niya. Uh, Mag-inject siya o larvae sa human skin. The, so, how is roundworm infection diagnosed? A person infected the roundworm has a tender or enlarged lymph nodes in the extremities. Then, diagnosis of the roundworm can be reached from these techniques. So first is that examine the tail portion, which is gonna be presence of a sheath and size of cephalic space. Then uh, second is using of recombinant antigen BMR1. Then how is roundworm infection treated? The mitigations used for the treatment of roundworm is diethyl carbamazine. That is para i-treat ang katong infection, ang diethylcarbamazine. 